Now in this video, I'm going to be showing you the best settings for the Soul Trading Bot so that you can trade faster and more efficiently. Now if you're yet to try out Soul Trading Bot for yourself, you can click my link at the very top of the video description and if you open that up, you'll get taken to a page like this where you can click open telegram and you'll get brought straight to this bot and you can click start to get started. Now in order to change our settings, we will see this welcome message here when we click start and we will see our settings right here. And the first settings we will see is auto buy and auto sell. Now for me personally, I don't actually use auto buy and auto sell just because I prefer to have more control over when I'm buying and selling. However, these can be good in certain scenarios. So for example, auto sell can be useful if you're sniping coins. And if you wanted to sell after a 2x or something like that, you could change this to 100%. And you could also turn it on by clicking this. And that means whenever your coin doubles, it will automatically sell it. But this does limit upside, so personally I keep this off, and I also keep auto buy off, because what auto buy does is it automatically buys it when you send in a contract address. And sometimes I just put in a contract address so I can see the market cap, I don't always want to buy it if I put in a contract address, so I leave this off. Now next up is anti-mev, and we can turn that on by clicking it, and what this would do is it will secure our transactions, but they will be a bit slower. So if you don't know what a MEV bot is, it's actually a bot that will try and front run your transaction and cause you to buy the coin for higher than you're trying to, which of course makes you lose money. So you can keep that on if you wanna be protected, but if you are sniping, I'd recommend you keep it off just cause it's gonna slow you down otherwise. Now for slippage buy sell, that is the amount of slippage that it will try and buy and sell tokens with. So in my opinion, 49% is a bit high. So I'd recommend setting that to something like 40%, and clicking enter and from there that should help us minimize some losses next up is the slippage for your sniper and by default this is set to a thousand but i set this to 1100 just so it's a bit higher i'm not sure if that actually does anything but i've used that strategy before and it has actually worked now next up is tip soul and the higher we put this the higher chance we have of actually buying coins without them failing so this is basically an incentive to put your transaction through first so you'll tip this amount of soul with each transaction and it should help you buy coins easier. And finally, there's the custom button, which if we change this to 100, for example, we can then go to buy a coin on buy mode. And as you can see, this one here is our custom amount, and we can see we can buy 100 soul. Now, of course, you wanna put this to whatever you want. So if you usually buy a set amount of soul for each coin, you can put that in here. And then when you do go to buy coins, you can simply click on that, and it'll make the process a lot faster. Now, as I mentioned earlier, if you want to try this bot out for yourself, click my link in the video description and you can get taken straight to this Telegram page and start using the bot today. But other than that, I hope you found this video helpful and thanks for watching.